We have another person whose stock is doing very well today, ICICI Securities. Vijay Chanduk, the Managing Director and CEO of ICICI Securities joins us. Uh, good morning, Mr. Chanduk. Thank you very much. Uh, well, very good uh, numbers. Uh, is this because a lot of new guys have flocked? Uh, how much of an increase in brokerage business have you uh, witnessed post-COVID? Uh, like in the thank first you very much, yeah, thank you very much, uh, Lata, and uh, thank you for having me on this show. Uh, yes, indeed, uh, uh, you know, last time when we probably met, we spoke about, you know, I wanted to just highlight the point that we are just participating in the larger trend that's there in India. Under penetration is there big time in the sector. Uh, we've been focused completely on the retail uh, uh, customer and uh, ensuring that we keep improving service to him, keep in, uh, bringing better products to him, keep bringing better pricing plans to him. And that's probably the reason why we've seen uh, growth. You specifically mentioned about uh, broking. Broking uh, revenues have actually doubled uh, during this period on a YOY. New clients, can you share? Uh, I'm sorry? How many new clients? So, uh, during this quarter, we added about uh, 113,000 uh, uh, new clients. Uh, this is the highest addition we've done uh, mm -hmm. in, in the last six quarters. Got that. Now, Vijay, good morning. Uh, you know, as I said, and uh, you know, uh, thanks for being candid. This is an industry phenomenon, right? And you are in the right industry right now. Uh, a lot of uh, trade from home, work from home going on. But uh, how would your number look, say, compared to the leader, uh, Zerodha? I mean, of course, you at one point were leaders. But uh, how, how are the numbers looking comparatively? And do you have plans to take back uh, the market share that you would have lost uh, over the last few years to Zerodha? So, indeed, if you look at uh, our numbers uh, and you look at our market share, since you're talking about that, uh, we've had a gain of about 240, 50 basis points in uh, equities market share uh, during the quarter on a YOY basis. Uh, when it comes to derivatives, our market share has gone up by about 150 basis points. So we are indeed uh, making uh, some uh, very positive uh, and encouraging strides in g gaining market share. Uh, I, I suppose you are using a, a, a very singular number, which is, uh, you know, NAC active customers. Uh, probably that's, uh, that's not a completely reflective number of the market uh, getting sort of seized from a revenue perspective. So when you look at this, I think uh, we are pretty uh, much on the right side of, uh, you know, the progress that we are making. We, if you also are talking about customers, then you have to keep in mind we've got about uh, 5 million customers uh, registered and uh, on our platform, right? So, uh, I think we are there and we continue to make progress. So, uh, Vijay, if you can tell us, you know, your active clients currently are at the highest ever at 1.56 million clients. Uh, what kind of growth, sustainable growth do you see for the rest of the year? So, if you look at our total active clients, uh, it increased by about 17% on a YOY basis. NEC active is up by about 32%. Um, I, I would sup suppose that, you know, our uh, clear uh, aspiration is to uh, participate in the, uh, the the swing that is happening in the market, greater uh, emphasis for, uh, you know, younger people to come into equity market, getting into investments. And, um, um, you know, do all the bunch of things that we can do to make our uh, growth uh, even faster than what we've seen. Our clear aspiration is to grow much faster. Two important initiatives that we've done in this uh, fiscal, uh, which uh, we are uh, very positive about, is two pivots, actually. One is we have pivoted to digital in a for the first time uh, in terms of acquisition. Up till uh, previous uh, period, you know, we were all digital in our acquisition. Yeah. So it's a very important pivot. Okay. And we expect benefits to continue. And the other important pivot we've done is we've pivoted to becoming an open architecture in terms of acquisition. Okay. So you can be an, any bank customer. Yeah, Bhutay, we're absolutely running into a uh, market opening. So very quickly, you know, non-broking uh, uh, business, you know, your other advisory business, PMS business, what can you forecast in terms of a growth? So when it comes to everything outside of equities, we've uh, actually had a, a very a strong increase in investment banking side. Uh, we've had a you know more than 85-90% market share uh, during this period. Um, a pipeline continues to remain healthy. Uh, distribution business we've seen an increase uh, on a sequential basis. Uh, given the fact that, you know, YOY, there was a actual decline. But we expect, uh, you know, as unlocking happens, this to continue and grow. Vijay, thanks a lot for joining us. That's ICICI Securities. Quickly, let's take the 910 calls. Uh, the pre-open has settled 96 points.